Do you need to receive serialized parts? I'm Lance with Brano Consulting, Fishbowl Expert since 2006. In this video we're going to receive serialized parts. So first of all, grab your scanner or your iPhone or your Android and log in to Fishbowl Go. Select Receive and select the purchase order you want to receive. Then tap on the part that is serialized and click Receive or Edit. Brings us to the quantity section. Tap on the serial number and begin scanning the serial numbers. So I just scanned 30 serial numbers. Looks like one of them is a little bit screwed up. So I'm going to delete that one and do that again. And this time be a little more careful with my scanning. So scan, 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 scan. Okay, that looks good. Now to double check my work, I just tap and move on the screen to scroll up to make sure I got them all. All right, so your vendor should have serial numbers on your parts. In the rare circumstance that your vendor does not have serial numbers on your parts and you require serial number tracking, you can come to the report screen in Fishbowl, look up the incremental tracking. Incremental tracking one off or new tracking incremental. The page that I just scanned was the incremental page and I just put 30 on a page. And Fishbowl will print out serial numbers for you. This part that I am working on receiving is this little Seagate portable external hard drive and if you look really close it's got a serial number on there. Now this serial number is teeny tiny and this cheap scan gun won't read it. This was like 80 bucks on eBay. Just something quick and easy and simple and it scans barcodes this size just fine. But to scan something teeny tiny like this you need something with HD scanning capability and DPM scanning capability. So you're going to pay a little bit more for a scan gun that reads uh, DPM. DPM just means that the barcode is laser printed on the product. So that's a DPM barcode right there. So this is just a barcode giant. People at Barcode Giant are helpful and friendly. You just tell them what you're looking for, what kind of barcodes you need to scan. And if your vendor is not giving you serial numbers on the part, it doesn't hurt to request. Just call them and say, hey, we want this tracked by serial number. Can you serialize it? And they may do that for you, especially if they're printing labels for you. It doesn't hurt to ask. We've got the We've got the serial number scanned in. I scanned 30. Let's say we want to save just 30. If I click receive, it's going to give me an error message because the quantity to receive is 100 and I only scanned 30. So I'm just going to change this to 30 and then click receive. We received 30. If we come here to the receiving screen right here and pull up the purchase order we're looking at, you notice that it doesn't say that it's received yet. I wanted to show you this because this is something 
that is a common mistake. The screen at this point needs to be saved. If you didn't receive everything, make sure to click save. And then you'll see the result over here on the screen. We received 30 of them. Thanks for joining us today at Brando Consulting. Hope to see you in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe and comment. If you have any questions, comment below.